Hello, my name is Kevin Treader, Product Marketer with Microchip Technologies Analog Division. This video will provide a quick overview of the MCP6N11 and MCP6V2X Wheatstone Bridge reference design, which features Microchip's first instrumentation amplifier, the MCP6N11 with MCAL technology. This reference design enables temperature measurement via the use of an RTD and a Wheatstone bridge configuration. The board demonstrates the performance of the MCP6N11 instrumentation amplifier and a traditional 3-op amp INA implementing the MCP6V2X family of auto-zeroed operational amplifiers. In addition to the two instrumentation front ends, the board implements a PIC18F2553 microcontroller. The microcontroller performs the A to D conversion of the INA output, provides a PWM output to generate an interference signal, performs all the needed calculations in firmware, including calibrating the RTD output, converting voltage to temperature, and averaging the ADC data. Finally, the PIC microcontroller interfaces with the PC via a USB port. The Wheatstone Bridge Reference Design Board comes with everything you see here including a fully assembled and tested board, a USB cable, and a CD, which includes all the documentation as well as the software for the GUI. Once the software is installed, simply connect the reference design to the PC using the supplied USB cable. The reference design board is powered via the USB port, so no external power supplies are required. Now let's take a closer look at the user interface. Once opened, the Wheatstone Bridge graphical user interface will display two tabs in the upper left-hand corner, along with a strip chart on the right-hand side. The Data View tab displays the current value of the RTD resistance and the resulting RTD temperature for each of the instrumentation front ends. Select reference voltages are also displayed, as shown on the block diagram at the bottom. The checkboxes on the block diagram select which data will be displayed in the strip chart. By selecting the play button in the upper left hand corner, the strip chart will begin to chart the selected data. The other tab is labeled additional configuration. This section allows the user to select a variety of options, including calibrating the RTD, calibrating the MCP6N11 instrumentation amplifier, change the temperature units, set the amount of averages, and also adjust the characteristics of the injected interference. Thank you for your time as we explored the MCP6N11 and MCP6V2X Wheatstone Bridge reference design. For more information or to place an order, visit microchip.com slash ARD00354.